Hey everyone, this is John Carrasco with Laguna Tools. Today we'll be going over how to remove the nozzle to clean your lens from your CO2 lasers. This will apply to the EX, MX, and the PL1220. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we wanna do is bring the table down. We are gonna get this done by pressing the ZU on your control and holding the right arrow down. This will bring the table down, bring it about five to seven inches, just enough clearance to let the nozzle drop down. Okay, so now we're gonna wanna remove the nozzle for the air. And then we're gonna wanna loosen up the brass knob. This will release the nozzle from its housing. Okay, so now that we have the nozzle removed, we can start the process of cleaning the lens. All right, now that we have the nozzle removed from the EX laser, we're gonna unscrew the tip and clean the lens. This is gonna work for the PL1220, the MX, and the EX CO2. What you wanna do is remove your nozzle from your CO2 laser. We're gonna remove the tip. And inside the tip, you're gonna see your laser CO2 lens. Uh, we're gonna take the little spatula that comes with the CO2 machine. And there are two grooves on each side. You're gonna wanna clip on those and unscrew the ring that holds the lens in place. Once you remove the uh, ring, the lens should drop. And now we can get to cleaning the lens. Uh, we're gonna be using alcohol. We have the wipes and the Q-tips uh, that we uh, have acquired from American Photonics. This is the kit that we have put together with American Photonics for our CO2 laser lenses. Uh, so what we're gonna wanna do is get the little vial, get a couple drops on the lens. I always wanna make sure you have gloves on, that way the oils don't get on the lens, that will damage your lens. And we're gonna wanna use the Q-tips, very careful cleaning the lens. So now that we have the top side clean, we're gonna turn it over and do a couple more drops. And repeat the process. And then go in there with your wipe and wipe it down. Once you have that clean, uh, now we're gonna put that lens back into the nozzle. The flat surface should be facing down and the curve should be facing up. The easiest way to do that, insert your lens, turn it over and insert the ring. Once you have the ring inserted into the nozzle, you're gonna wanna do the exact same process, screwing the ring back onto the nozzle. So now that we have the lens back in the nozzle, we're gonna wanna screw the tip of that nozzle back into its place, and we're ready to uh, get this laser working. Okay, now that we cleaned the lens, we're gonna reverse the process. We're gonna bring the nozzle back into its housing. First thing we're gonna wanna do is bring the nozzle back in. Screw the knob, brass knob, and reattach the air hose to the nozzle. We're all set. Thank you again for watching. Hope this video helps with maintaining your CO2 laser, whether you have the EX, MX, or the PL1220. Uh, please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to our channels. If you have any questions, reach out to us, lagunatools.com. Thank you.